This is the Next Level device, a unique piece of rehabilitative equipment designed for those who have various forms of neck dysfunction, discomfort, or pain. And for a clinician such as myself who treats neck pain and injuries all day long, when I learned about this little device, I couldn't wait to get my hands on it for the sake of my patients. And now that I've used it long enough to determine whether or not it can benefit those whom I treat, it's time for a review. So let's get to it. Hey everyone, we're getting right into the review here. Timestamps are in the description if you wanna just jump around. And as we get going here, I wanna quickly mention that I have no affiliation with the Next Level company, and I've paid for this device with my own money. Now, Next Level does not get any input as to what I say in this video, and they do not get to see it before it's released. And all thoughts and opinions within this video are my own. So the Next Level device is a neck strengthening and rehabilitation piece of equipment that works via a sliding board with resistance tubing attached at either end. And to use it, you simply wrap the included headband around your forehead, which helps to grip the foam board that you rest your head on. And from there, you can perform various rotational, isometric or eccentric movements to target and strengthen specific muscles within the neck. You can also therefore use this device to even help mobilize some of the joints within the cervical spine, which tends to be quite therapeutic for those who need it. And keep in mind that there are more ways to use this device than what I cover within this video, but from my YouTube analytics, I'm informed that most of you are interested in videos that are around six or seven minutes tops, so I'm going to try and cap this video at around the seven minute mark. Now, the next level device can be used for various forms of injury prevention, which we call prehabilitation, or prehab for short. However, where it really shines is with injury rehabilitation. Necks can be incredibly sensitive and intricate when it comes to performing the right exercises, movements, and manual therapy techniques for eliminating pain and dysfunction. And what I absolutely love about this device is how well suited it is for early stage rehabilitation from various injuries such as whiplash associated disorder. Again, to be clear, just as with any other product on the face of the earth, there are times where it might not be appropriate to use, but for whom those it's appropriate for, it can produce some absolutely brilliant results. Now, the first thing to mention here is that this device is actually intended for clinicians rather than for home use. Now, not because it's a complicated piece of equipment to use, but rather due to its price point. In my online talks with the inventor of this device, I was told that it's marketed to clinics and clinicians specifically for this reason. Now, don't get super bummed out here though, because from my talks with Dr. Scott Dickinson, who is the inventor of this device, it seems that there may be a home version coming down the lines, which I'm certainly hoping for because I feel that there aren't many devices out there on the market that can treat specific neck conditions the way that this device can. Now, assuming you're not a clinician, you may be wondering what the point of me reviewing this little device is when it's likely far beyond a price point or price range that you'd be willing to spend your money on? And that's more than a fair question to ask. First of all, anytime I come across a company with a great product and good people behind that product, I like to raise awareness as to what they offer, as I feel that they deserve the publicity, especially when they're not all that well known. Now, I've had some back and forth online conversations with Dr. Dickinson, who is a fellow doctor of physical therapy, such as myself, and he's been more than pleasant to communicate with, and so that's the first reason. The second reason is that I enjoy making content that could help my viewers in any way possible, even if it's simply just to let you know that this device exists. And there are plenty of clinics out there who use this device, and you can find many of them online on the Next Level website where they have a clinic locator. So with that being said, maybe we'll just get the only negative I have with this device out of the way, and that'll leave all the amazing things that I love about this device to be discussed after this only drawback. And trust me, there's way more good to discuss here than there is bad. As always, I believe it's important for one to spend their money wisely. And while this device is absolutely a solid piece of equipment that I wholeheartedly endorse, it is quite expensive. However, if you're purchasing this device as a clinician, I'd say that this device is simply an investment as depending on how your clinical practice is set up, you can likely make your money back on it within a short period of time. So keep that in mind. Nonetheless, I would also like to remind everyone that I have no idea how much it costs to do research and development for a product, nor do I know how much it costs to advertise and campaign for a product. And so I'm truly never comfortable with giving my thoughts on a product's price point. I'm just a physical therapist and really nothing more than that. And this is the same thing I said when reviewing another neck strengthening device here on my channel, where yes, I wish that the price point was lower, but I'm not gonna sit here and tell any company to change their price point when I simply don't know what goes into determining how much it costs. But I can understand for some how cost can certainly be a deterrent for this device. But looking beyond this, I have nothing negative to say about this device, nor do practically any of my patients who have used it. The build quality is on point, the portability and non-intimidating nature of this little device are also outstanding features, and the board is buttery smooth when sliding from left to right. The headband itself is comfortable, as is the foam pad on the board, which can be replaced if needed. And the resistance on the resistance tubes covers an ideal range of resistance, ranging from extremely light to quite challenging. 
with the added option to purchase even more aggressive tubing if needed. And I'll tell you that when it comes to dealing with various types of neck injuries and neck pain, you can never have such thing as too gentle of a resistance band. And while at first glance, it may not look like there's much versatility to be offered with this device, there is more to it than meets the eye. So long as you understand the general anatomical, biomechanical, and physiologic principles of the neck, which any licensed physical therapist or other similar allied healthcare professional absolutely will. Some of my favorite exercises that I've had great success with for my patients have included various ranges of motion with cervical rotations, isometric contractions, which in this case can be thought of as anti-rotation contractions, as well as eccentric rotations. I also tend to use my squat wedges to angle the device so that the neck is slightly flexed when performing some of these exercises, which can help to bias more of the mid and upper neck. And depending on the needs of my patients, I'll even use the board for upper cervical flexion or what we sometimes call cranial vertebral flexion. As with plenty of other devices out there, if you're willing to get a bit creative, you can really do some great things. So the next level device is a fantastic cervical device that I am so happy to be incorporating for much of my cervical rehab for my patients. And I am thrilled that I get to make some content with my thoughts pertaining to it to help my online audience become aware of its existence. And if you're in need of some neck rehabilitation, take the time and effort to find a licensed individual whom you feel has your best interest when getting you back to where you wanna be. Rehab is never all that fun of a process, but there are so many individuals out there, such as myself, who want the best for you. So hopefully this quick little rundown and review on the Next Level device has been helpful and informative. And if so, please don't shy away from liking this video and feel free to subscribe if you'd like to stay up to speed on the content I'm producing for all you amazing individuals. So in the meantime, keep looking after yourselves, keep looking after one another, keep making great things happen, and I'll see you in the next video.